Hello and welcome to CV News Digest, Fash on Trend, where we fill you up with the fashion industry's latest trends. So today we have for you the Spring 2023 Trends Part 2. So trend number one that we have for you is lingerie. Bra top, satin slip dresses, DC bodysuits are taking center stage for the Spring 2023 trend. And also thanks to the sheer trend that we talked about in our previous video. So lingerie was one of the main draws of the season from many designers. Tom Ford, known for his 90s minimalist sensuality, did just that, but for the Gen Z consumer. Ford served fetish wear in a commercial fashion, nodding to today's gender fluidity with black leather jackets, lace triangle bras, and flip-flops, having the Tom Ford logo on all of them. Versace's take on the boudoir bride and Ian Westwood's medieval corset queen were also great examples of, of the dynamism and depth of the spring 2023 lingerie fashion trend. So yeah, we can see that the lingerie trend is back, but it's not back because of Y2K. Tasteful execution and a lack of sexual charge are essential, believing that showing the body started more as a trend continued and is becoming a statement of empowerment and making the female body acceptable instead of being either scared or sexualizing it. Trend number two is textures. So rich textures including feather, fringes and tassels and even more made an appearance during the spring summer 2023 runway shows. One designer, Kei Nunomiya, for his Mystic Force Noir Spring Collection, took tactile fabrics to a whole new level with the use of ethereal feathers, mesh plastic tubes, and a variety of ruched fabrics. Also for her show in Paris, Victoria Beckham presented a collection full of tactile embellishments, such as fringes and tassels, including clutches that made models look as if they were carrying mop dogs. And the third and final trend, denim. Runway denim is here to stay. Utility cargo jeans and baggy pants, bringing back denim's cool casual factor. So denim dominated everywhere, but nothing screamed denim fever like diesel, where designer Glenn Martins blow broke the world record by hosting a 5,000 person show. With Y2K in mind, the collection continued to, to prove Martin's masterful approach to denim construction and fabric manipulation, which includes denim interwoven on organza, and also tulle was overlaid on denim coats and pencil skirts and ripped to create a new way of offering a distressed effect. Versace also explored with acid washes, but Donatella Versace took it a step further by adding colored denim to the mix, such as lime yellow and pink. So tell us out of the three trends, which one is your favorite? Thank you for tuning in CV News Digest Fash on Trend. We are here bi-weekly giving you the latest fashion trends in the fashion industry. Give us a follow on social media and also subscribe for three times a week News Digest videos on YouTube. We'll be back very, very soon.